Hello guys, what's up? Welcome to the new tutorial from the uh, SketchUp Arc Studio. In this case, I'm going to show you how we can create some floor plan in SketchUp with using the uh, AutoCAD. So, we have the uh, floor plan in here, some type of simple walls without any type of windows or doors. So, first of all, I do the uh, boundary job on this work and now we have some type of complete complex and flexible plan in here so i'm going to click on the uh save in here and save as drawing so on the desktop and drawing number one dwg is good so i'm going to click on the desktop and press save so i will go to the uh, sketchup in here First of all, I'm going to delete this character, click on the window, model info, purge and use and fix problems. So I'm going to press Ctrl S and save this file on my desktop with any type of name that you want. So I'm going to click on the file option and we have some type of option that called import. So I'm going to click on the import and we can see the uh, drawing one DWG AutoCAD drawing. So I use AutoCAD 2024 and I'm going to click on it, click on the options. And as you can see, first of all, my drawing unit in AutoCAD was the uh, meter. So I'm going to change it to the meter. Geometry is some type of merge coplanar faces or orient faces. But both of them is not important, only click on the import materials and only you can uncheck it sometimes, but I prefer to check it and preserve drawing origin is a good point. So I'm going to click on the OK and select it and click on the import. It takes a little bit time and you can see the final result in here. So when I click on it, this is the simple group in this place. But before I click on it and explode it, I want to draw some type of rectangle in here. And now I'm going to click on it, right click and click on the uh, explode option. So I'm going to hold Ctrl and A, press Ctrl A to select all of them. Click on it and we have some option that called interface with model or selection. I'm going to click on the interface with model and it helps you to have some type of clear wall welding in SketchUp 3D environment. So I'm going to click on the eraser and erase these extra lines in here and I'm going to click on it and this is the plan that we have in there. So I can click on the uh, push or pull option in here, press Ctrl and start my modeling. For example, I have some house with some height about 4 meter for example and the floor height is something about 20 centimeters. So I can add the uh, doors for this place. For example, I can use the uh, tape measure like that. Add some dimensions, very simple. Click on the rectangle, draw some another rectangle and push or pull it to the back side and we generate the uh, door place for our floor plan. So I can delete these tape measure lines in there and for example we can add some windows in here. So I can use the tape measure something about maybe 90 centimeter is good for this place and this place. Another one for here. Click on the rectangle and draw your window place. So you can use the extrude option and move it back like that very simple and easy as you can see you can create this plan very easy with the uh, autocad and sketchup so some other details you can watch my previous tutorials about the interior design modeling and rendering so for the final i want to export this job but i don't know how so the best way for doing this job is related to using the uh, export option so I'm going to adjust it a little bit by my personal setting. Click on the file, export 2D graphics. And for example, on the desktop, I want some type of JPG progress. Click on the options. The size of it is good. I can use the view size. 
OK and export. So when I close the uh, SketchUp in there and go to CAD 2, I can see the final result in here, something like that. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe our YouTube channel. Thanks for your watching and goodbye.